Shell. Eco Styler Gel. Pink is my favorite. <laughs> So you guys were ratting and raving about that gel so much that I decided to finally give it a try. Here I'm starting off on an old wash and go. I think this wash and go I used the Eco Styler Gel Argan Oil. So my hair is dry by now and it's just time to replenish. I'm going to use the VO5 and Extra Virgin Coconut Oil and mix that all into a bowl to deep condition my hair. I put my hair into sections and then I apply my conditioner in the four sections just like anybody else would and I go ahead and finger detangle my hair in the four sections before I sit with the plastic cap under my hooded dryer for about 30 minutes. Now that my hair is clean, I'm going to go ahead and start to style my hair. You guys already know, but I'm going to use the Paul Mitchell deconditioner conditioner as my leave-in, and I'm just going to work that into both sides of my hair. So this is the Eco Styler Gel. It's for curls and waves, and it is a level 8. I'm going to apply this to my hair like I do every other Eco Styler Gel. I start by applying it to the whole section of my hair and then I'm going to shingle the rest of it. As I'm shingling my hair, I can tell that this product reminded me a lot of the Protein Eco Styler Gel, which is also a level 8. But one thing that I didn't particularly care for with this Eco Styler Gel is that it seemed like it took me a lot longer to smooth my hair. And it seems like it took a lot longer overall to style my hair because my hair just wasn't getting as smooth as it would with other Eco Styler Gels. When I got to the front of my hair, which is usually the part that gets frizziest the quickest, I even noticed that I had to shingle my hair in smaller sections because my hair was getting frizzy really fast. So this is the final result and I'm just going to let my hair dry for about two hours but I was exhausted by the time I finished like I needed to crack my back and my neck I was tired y'all. Okay guys so these are the final results and this is my hair using the Eco Styler Gel Pink which is for curls and waves. I wanted to come and talk to you guys personally and let you know my experience with it. After it was all said and done, this is how much I ended up using for my wash and go. So I used about that much out of the jar. I don't know. I'm just not overly impressed with it. Um, I guess because maybe my hopes were too high going into it and people like just ranting and raving like, oh my God, I love this product. I don't know. I guess when I put it on my hair, I expected my curls to just not be my curls or something for it to change my hair, which we know it doesn't do it. I don't know. I guess I expected my curls to walk on water. Being a level eight, I don't know if you guys can see that on my camera, but with it being a level eight, I knew it wasn't going to give me the same results as say my Eco Styler Gel Argan Oil or the Eco Styler Gel Olive Oil. So I knew it was going to be a light hold and I um figure it was going to be a wash and go similar to my protein eco styler gel which is also a level eight the pros with this product is um absolutely the smell this is one of the most pleasant smelling eco styler gels of all the eco stylers that i have used and then also if you want a lightweight hold and one of the eco styler gels that is a lot easier to um i guess rake if you are into raking and instead of shingling or smoothing this is a good raking gel would i repurchase it sure i mean i like to have different eco styler gels on hand just because you know you never know how you're feeling that day what kind of hair you're going for as you guys can see you can already tell this is my day one hair and this hair is a lot bigger than my day four or five hair 
that um, I started off in the beginning of this video. So this is going to give you a lighter hold. It's going to give you a fluffier, lightweight, bigger wash and go look. So that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll see you in the next one. I don't want no